Hi, I'm Drew Rodriguez. And I'm Jared Allen. And today we're going to show you how to add positive and negative integers using multiple methods. When you add positive and negative integers, there are many methods you can use. One method when adding integers with different signs is the absolute value method. Absolute value is the distance an integer is away from zero. An integer's absolute value is always positive. Why? Distance is measured in positive units. You can't have a negative yard or foot or inch. We will use the expression positive 7 add negative 14 to illustrate. First, we'll write down our expression. Then we'll write equal signs beneath it. We need to find the absolute value of each integer. To show this, write positive 7 and negative 14 in absolute value symbols like this. Since negative 14 is 14 units to the left of 0, its absolute value, or distance from 0 is 14 units. Since positive 7 is 7 units to the right of 0, its absolute value, or distance from 0, is 7 units. Now we will subtract our absolute values, 14 minus 7 equals 7. Since 14 is the greater absolute value, we will take the sign of negative 14. Therefore, positive 7 plus negative 14 equals negative 7. Why take the sign of the negative 14? Why would our answer be negative 7 and not positive 7? We can use a number line to help show this. We are going to use the same expression, positive 7 add negative 14. First we'll draw a number line. Then we'll plot our positive 7, 7 units to the right of 0. When we add on a number line, we move to the right, but we are adding negative 14, or the opposite of 14, which means we move in the opposite direction. In other words, we move to the left. Moving to the left on a number line is subtracting. Therefore, adding a negative is equivalent to subtracting a positive. We have to jump a total of 14 units to the left of positive 7 on our number line. First, we can jump 7 units to the left and land on 0. Then we can subtract 7 more by jumping to the left again. We land on negative 7. We have a negative answer because we move further to the left than we did to the right carried us back into the negative territory. The final way we could simplify positive 7 add negative 14 is using tile spacers. With tile spacers, we will first write out 7 positive signs and 14 negative signs. Adding is combining. That means we will find our zero pairs, which are 1 positive and 1 negative. Combine 7 positives with 14 negatives. You will be left with 7 0 pairs and there will be 7 negatives, or the opposite of 7, left over. We have shown you three different methods for adding integers. We recommend not using the tile spacers method for large integers. For a more visual method, use the number line. For getting it done quick but right, use the absolute value method when you're adding two integers with different signs. Hope you enjoyed learning how to add integers using multiple methods. I'm Jared. And I'm Drew. Thanks for watching.